Hi ladies, let's now talk about eyes. So uh, I'm wearing right now some system texture on eyes but are not the one that come inside of head pack. But inside of head pack you have the system eyes texture. Those system textures are the same you will find on your head. The big difference between system and eyes applier is that you cannot apply different color in each eyes, but all other features will work with both versions of eyes. So I will wear the first one, the far one that is this one. See, it's the same that color. Uh, if you want to use this one, you can still use all this section I will be explaining in a few. But since the applier version is the more complete option, I will wear the applier one right now so I can show you all eye section. Now, when you add the alpha, your eyes will become red. This is not a bug, it's not a problem, it's not a mess of eyes, it's not a problem of head. It's just like our bacon mesh work. So you just need then to apply a texture on it. Now, this texture can be a Nakeruka Advanced Applier or can be also, remember ladies, Akeruka Advanced Eyes Applier need to be Advanced Eyes so it can work with left and right option by selecting on the hood. But you can use also Omega Applier but cannot be an applier eye made for another Akeruka head. Okay, need to be or Omega or Advanced. If you want all things to work properly, okay, and we want it to work properly. So, uh, let me show you what I mean by heterochromia. Well, I can close this now. So, heterochromia is that if I want to apply on left side another color, I just select left here and I apply a color. If I want to do the same thing with the right one, I will select right and I will apply a color. If I want to change the color of both, I select both and I apply a color. Okay? So I think this is very clear about these. Okay? And you, we do that for cat eyes too and for any advanced applier you wear. Okay? Uh, any eyes applier you wear. Now let's go to eyes FX effect. Like I said, this section will work as same also if you are not using a plier. If you are using a system texture on eyes, this section will work exactly the same. Well, just the offset, but I will show you why. Now, um, no, also the offset, sorry, also the offset is not that the point. I will be explaining. Let me do step by step because I let... I get lost, you know, my brain is a bit mess, so let's go step by step. Now, we have here three style of reflection, okay? So you can use the first one, the second one, and the third one. I'm in love with this one, it's so cute. But let's say we don't want it to be that much intense, we want it more natural, less and so and you just move this blend reflection, okay? And I don't know if you remember, some time ago on, Delu on Deluxe Head, we have Deluxe Eyes, we had some problem because they was glow all the time. Well, now you will not have this problem. If you want them glow, you just go here and they will be glow. If you want them to not be glow, you just move them to zero and it will take off, okay? Let's say you apply a texture that is too much big for your eyes, okay? And uh, you want it to look smaller, you just go on resize, okay? Resize, or same thing if you want them bigger, you go on resize. Now, I will apply a texture of mine uh, to show you how you can use this offset stuff, okay? So let me see one of my lasted eyes made. 
just give me a second i know i had to do this before to do the video but i'm not that much organized so i will uh, um, apply i will take off this text right now actually so i can show you that this work also with system text i will take off the alpha see i will take off the system eyes alpha Toolkit off, okay, and you will see the eyes will go out because it's not baked, it's not uh, active the bacon mesh stuff. So we just click on bacon mesh here, and the eyes go back to the normal. And I will apply some of my system eyes, and you will see um, the texture is uh, uh, well, let me do that to load or quicker the texture, just a second. It's not loading. Why is not loading? I really don't know why it's not loading. Okay, it loaded. So, um, it's not the one I wanted, actually. I want this one, the first one. <laughs> okay. You see the eyes is bigger and is not really on, on right position we want it to be. So I will resize the eyes so I can show you everything you can do with it. And let's say I want this black stuff to be a bit more lower. I will select them both because I want to move both eyes. And I will just use the offset C to adjust the position. Okay, uh, if the eyes, for example, was too much on top, uh, too much on bottom, and you want to move on top, you do the same thing with the arrow on top. And this is amazing because usually we cannot move the rigged eyes, rigged stuff uh, in general. Okay, so you can do this with this offset stuff, and you can resize a text to if the Eyes you purchased had a big, uh, big eyelid section. You can resize it because you know uh, most of designer myself also we are working actually in one generic size texture and in one Omega applier, for example. And uh, not always is the exact size of the eyes. Okay. So, or not exactly the same position, uh, texture of eyes. So, we can adjust these with the resize and the offset option. And you can do this with the system texture and with the applier texture, okay? It will work for both. Now, let's say you like the full bright option on eyes, okay? Then you can just active full bright and your eyes will become full bright. If you want shyness and glossness, see, it added a shine stuff. Let's say you want more gloss. This is not too much. Well, okay, for my taste, it's not that much natural because I don't like leaves like this. Then you lower the color intensity. Okay, you have still them glossy. Now, sec, I will put the texture of a Kiruka head because it's better to show this effect because have less gloss on, well, don't have gloss at all on them. So you can see exactly all effect of, of your head. See? So now we have this gloss on eyes. We lower the intensity. Okay. Let's put this lower. And color intensity lower, or a bit more height here. Okay. Now you have also environment. You know, some people like to have uh, fantasy eyes, and so you can play with those stuff now and have some different look on the eyes. Let me put, for example, uh, a cat eye. This is see. This is an applier. Uh, this is an applier, so you need to use what? Your system alpha. Okay, system alpha, and it went fixed. Just need to wait this texture to load. Okay, it's loading. 
So see, you have this amazing effect, the environment. Let me lower this color intensity. And the gloss is heighter. So to hide the intensity of color. And then you have a lot of amazing, see, effect on eyes as well. Well, you can play with these uh, and have the look you want, the look you like most. I'm not much into shyness and stuff like this. I'm more natural looking style. But uh, I know, uh, you know, we are doing a herd to please uh, every type of customer. So some people might like uh, some, time or some type of uh, product. Some people might like another type of product. In this way, we can please everybody. I hope uh, this uh, tutorial helped you to know what you can do with the, the eye section as well. And you can have fun with them. Uh, you know, sometimes I do some mistake on video, but this is good because I show you also how to fix them. So, and uh, those mistakes can be made by you also. And sometimes it just get lost, you know. So um, I hope this video was helpful for you. And I will be showing the FX tab on next video. Ciao!